Hi, Mike's Carburetor Parts here. In this video, we're going to uh, talk about understanding your Quadrajet carburetor. The Rochester Quadrajet carburetor, a mainstay in many classic cars, is a marvel of automotive engineering. Its intricate design and efficient operation have made it a favorite among car enthusiasts and mechanics alike. In this video, we'll delve into the mechanics of the Quadrajet, exploring its unique features like the spreadboard design and understanding why it was considered ahead of its time. First introduced by Rochester in the 1960s, the Quadrajet is a four-barrel carburetor that gained widespread use in American cars. It was particularly popular in uh, General Motors vehicles, but was also used by other manufacturers, Mercury Marine, for example. The Quadrajet is known for its versatility, able to support a wide range of vehicles, engines from small V6s to big block V8s. One of the most distinctive features of the Quadrajet is its spread bore design. Unlike the typical square bore carburetors where the Venturi and throttle bores are of similar sizes, the Quadrajet has smaller primary bores paired with larger secondary bores. This design is ingenious for several reasons. Improve fuel efficiency. The smaller primary bores allow for better fuel economy during low speed driving and idle conditions as they provide a more precise fuel air mixture with less air resistance. Enhance performance. The larger secondary bores kick in during high demand situations like acceleration or climbing, providing additional air and fuel for increased power. This dual nature of the Quadrajet allows it to offer both efficiency at low speeds and power when needed, a balance that was quite advanced for its time. The Quadrajet uses a complex system of metering rods and jets to regulate the fuel flow. The medium rods which move in and out of the jets adjust the effective size of the jets based on the engine's demand. This setup allows for a more precise control of the fuel-air mixture across different engine loads and conditions, contributing to the carburetor's efficiency and responsiveness. The Quadrajet utilizes an air valve secondary system, which is distinct from the mechanical secondary systems found in many other carburetors. <coughs> This system is designed to respond to the engine's actual demand for air and fuel rather than opening at a predetermined rate or position of the throttle. The secondary system in a quadrajet is vacuum operated. It consists of a pair of large secondary throttle plates coupled with an air valve at the top of the carburetor. This air valve is controlled not mechanically but by engine vacuum and airflow. When the engine is at low speed or idle, the air valve remains closed, preventing the secondary throttle plates from opening. Smooth transition. One of the significant advantages of this system is the smooth transition between the primary and secondary barrels. It prevents a sudden rush of fuel that can occur in mechanically operated secondaries, reducing the risk of blogging, excuse me, bogging or flooding the engine. Improved fuel economy. At lower speeds and loads, the engine runs primarily on the smaller, more efficient primary barrels. The secondary bar barrels only engage when necessary, contributing to better overall fuel economy. Enhanced performance. When the engine requires more power, the secondary barrels open up to provide a larger volume of air and fuel mixture, enhancing the engine's performance. The vacuum operated system is self-adjusting, meaning it responds directly to the engine's demands without the need for manual adjustments or tuning to suit different driving conditions. The Quadrajet was ahead of its time for several reasons. Number one, versatility. Its ability to adapt to different engine requirements made it extremely versatile. Fuel efficiency. At a time when fuel efficiency was becoming more important, the Quadrajet offered an effective solution. Maybe remember those long gas lines in the early 70s? 
performance. It provided an excellent balance between fuel economy and high performance, a feature that was hard to achieve in carburetors of that era. The Rochester Quadrajet carburetor remains a fascinating piece of automotive history. Its innovative design and efficient performance set it apart in the era of carburetor engines. Understanding the mechanics behind the Quadrajet not only helps in maintaining and tuning these classic components, but also offers a glimpse into a pivotal era of automotive engineering. For enthusiasts and technicians alike, the Quadrajet is a testament to the ingenuity and adaptability of automotive technology. Excuse me. So uh, I appreciate you watching my videos. I'll leave some links in the description about how to get parts for your Quadrajet. And again, thanks for watching. See you later.